Live from KTVN Reno, you're watching 2 News at 5. Boy, some heavy smoke settled over downtown Reno this afternoon. I'm Kristen Revington. I'm Ryan Canada. Thanks for keeping it here. I saw it driving into work, Me looked too. at my work email. We already had a crew on scene. Now that cloud was coming from a house fire that broke out around 1 o'clock this afternoon. And we have a look at where the fire started. This is along 5th near Ralston Street and Arlington Avenue. And that's where we find Jefferson Tyler live at the scene with the latest details. Jefferson, first off, were there people inside when fire crews arrived there? Well, actually, there were no people inside. The house is considered abandoned. And Reno Fire Department says that no one was hurt in the blaze and that the buildings were, surrounding buildings were evacuated, but many of those buildings are back, and those businesses in surrounding and in the area are back to open once again. Now, if you look at the video here, you can actually see two additional engines had to be called in just to deal with the intensity of the flames. It was so intense that firefighters had to attack it from the outside because they couldn't get inside to deal with it. Reno Fire says there are signs that squatters have been in the building and was slated for demolition. The fire is considered suspicious in nature and they are investigating. From what I understand, NV Energy had shut the gas off a couple of days prior and the electricity had been shut off approximately two hours before the call came in. Now, these streets still are blocked off right now, so you want to avoid the area if you can. The Reno Fire Department says at this point they are still keeping an eye on the scene and mopping up right now, but it is under control and out at this point. Covering the story, Jefferson Tyler, 2 News.